Hello and welcome back. Now that we have created a catalog profile, we are going to assign it to M2 notification. What this means is that this profile will be available for every M2 notification that is being created. A point to note though is that you can also assign it to either an equipment or a functional location. So let us go again to notification content then to change catalogs and catalog profile for notification type. So we are going to open this and it gets us to a list of notification types that you can create. We are going to scroll down to M2 notification. So we click on that and it gets us to a field where we are supposed to populate our new catalog profile. So it's going to be test one. This is what we created on the previous video. And you can pick it up from the list. If you have different uh, catalogs, you can select from this list. So in our case, we are looking for test right here you double click on it and here it is that is test catalog so we are going to assign that and we save and that has been assigned to M2 notification so what this means is that every M2 notification that you're going to create will be assigned this catalog profile and we are going to see this in the, in the next video where we are going to create a notification and see how that is going to work.